Okay, there we go. Hey everyone, it's Precious Rutland and my sidekick here with me today, Brandy. Why is he trying to take all the camera? Y'all see this? <laughs> These doggone preteens. Anyway, he came with me today to the um, Healthy Planet um, Natural Health Expo. So I just wanted to do a quick recap about what we learned in there the today. Yes, it is. Okay, uh -huh. Um, so some great things in there and I just love coming out to these things like I said um, one just to learn because I'm always continuing to learn with natural health you never stop learning and two just to expose um, the boys the whole family actually and, and get them acclimated you know just about the importance of health and nutrition can you please stay out that camera and let me goodness y'all see he trying to hog <laughs> the camera so it was some really good things in there today um, there's some chiropractors in there so I got a chance to do a free um, spinal um, adjustment so it was some good information in there um, and one thing that was pointed out you know um, as a woman always carrying those heavy bags and so um, we have a tendency to lean one way so definitely was an eye-opener that you know I need to start um, lightening my load if I could do that per se so yeah. that wasn't too shocking that was good then we came across um, plant plant your herb so that was really good it's actually yeah. a really um, neat idea it's where you can grow your own little herb garden um, it doesn't have dirt or anything it was lightweight I think they're gonna be um, offering this on Amazon soon so that yeah. was really good so they said for around like were they I think they said it was on sale for like $19 on well Amazon. yeah they were yeah and then um, there was another guy in there um, he was from St. Louis Allergy Relief Center so you know we all have uh, allergies and so forth and so that was very um, informative and so they have their own protocols um, on how to help you know if you have seasonal allergies throughout the year um, so that can help um, as far as just you know managing it and because like I said as I teach um, in all my other videos that you hear me talking about um, you can't just treat one thing you have to treat your whole body so definitely with allergies um, you have to look at all components as well to make sure you're managing it um, then there was the gateway greenery so of course you know I like to do hiking so of course I had to make sure I got a different map um, so we can know where the different trails are and things and sometimes they yeah. always update um, the trails and things in the map so we want to make sure we had the latest and greatest there so that was good family hiking trips you become yeah we do do family hiking trips and then um, of course there was another open house and I had been to this um, place before it's the st. Louis Wellness Center mm -hmm. so that was good um, so they'll be having their open house um, next week yeah. so um, I may pop in there um, It'll help me give me some ideas from when I do my open house. I had to postpone mine, uh, unfortunately, but I'm definitely going to get mine um, planned again when um, the time is right. Um, there is also some um, energy healers in there. I hadn't heard of, had not heard of pranic healing before, so that was new to me. So I got some information on that. So that was neat to learn about um, and then there was also um, a representative in there for a juice plus um, I kind of had heard a little bit about it kind of haven't if you've heard some things about juice plus before um, share your comments let me know what you think about it if you've used it before so I thought it was really good I was really interested in it um, just for having a different alternative you know for the kids because I'm just training them um, to pay more attention be more conscious of what don't be over here huffing and puffing to pay more attention to what they're eating um, stop um, you know always grabbing for these um, sugars and sweets and things like it's okay to eat but you more so want to get your nutrition um, you know to keep your immune system healthy um, and you know just help with your growth system overall and just keep back some of these diseases because a lot of these things that's going on in our body these illnesses and things we can prevent these things um, and it all starts with us you know we have to be conscious of everything that we're putting in our body so that was yeah. really good and then um, there was also um, 
a business there talking about osteohealth and you know how to get strong bones and how to um, actually you know nourish them because after you get past a certain age I think she said after um, age 30 you know we start losing a little bit of um, muscle and density and stuff in the bone so like I said our whole body all this plays a big part in what we do oh and then also um, there was what a vegan um, kitchen in there Brandon really like he got a chance to get a sample what was the sample that you got it was the vegan no nut non gluten um, fudge brownie yeah fudge brownie so of course he slopped that down you know mm -hmm. these kids like they sweet and then we really um, ran into a really great girl. Um, she um, does a lot of, um, what's it called, I guess, herbs and mm -hmm. florists yeah. and stuff like that. So she was um, really good, very insightful um, as far as sharing some information with me for Brandon because he's um, into um, gardening and herbs and stuff and considering being a botanist. So it was really good to connect with her. So it's just always encouraging. Like I said, I love coming out to these health fairs things um, you know to learn about myself oh and I also got you know to talk about uh, my business and tell you know some of the people in there what I do as well and hand out my card so you it's good to go you never know who you will connect with and um, that's what I learned so that's encouraging you all if you get a chance to go to some natural health fairs um, go you never know what you'll learn who you'll meet and it can spark some ideas in you any last comments, Mr. Rutland? I just think they're really fun to go to just because, like, they have so many interesting things that I haven't heard of before in different businesses I wouldn't have even thought of. And they have, like, really cool things that they um, offer for their own businesses. And I think it's just really cool to for them to come over here to the expos and show off what they can do. So they can eventually like show off and basically just share what they share what they learn and basically use their talents and it's really fun well awesome thanks guys for watching until next time be blessed yes